Hi everyone, I'm George and welcome back to the Anime Grove. Today it's time for Arcane Season 1 Episode 3 Reaction. During last episode, Vi ended up sacrificing herself so they wouldn't take um, Jinx and everyone in Son that she cared about, I guess, because a war was about to start. Marcus was on their tail and he wouldn't give up. I think he was uh, tipped by... Wilco? Or Milko? I'm not sure now what the name is of the mob, but the one work working with Singed or Singed, again, I don't know how to pronounce it. So she handed herself over to the Piltover police and she was taken into custody, I guess. Now, will it be a time skip or will we see how Jinx reacts, how the news shock her? Don't know. Have no idea, let's jump in and see what happens. Also remember Jace and Victor and their kind of friendship started when they started respecting each other's um, scientific accomplishments. So, so many possibilities. Or also Heimerdinger. Ah, so many characters, it was so cool. Let's get into it and see what happens. As this is in the market substitute, so grab your legal copy and watch it along with me. And remember, if you enjoy my content, to leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe to join the Keepers of the Grove and help me continue growing the channel. But now, without any further ado, let's get into it. Arcane Season 1, Episode 3, Reaction. Go! Who this now? Silco? Not Wilco, but Silco. Oh shit, is this the blonde boy transforming? Deckard? No, this is Vilko. Silko. Shit. That scared the shit out of me. Is this Silko's origin story? Who tried to kill him? It wasn't enough. He, it gave him the resolve to continue fighting. Wait, is that Vander? That looked so much like Vander. Right? Fuck! Oh shit, he got there in time? Didn't think he would. I thought they had got her. What is he going to do? Shit, is he going to turn himself? Say it was him so they don't catch them? No, Vander, man. I liked you. She knows it. She also cares for their uh, well being. Well, everyone's. I don't know what I mean. Wait, what's happening? Is there a monster on the loose or something? Oh shit! Wait! What? Is she dead? Oh fuck! What the hell? No, Benzo! Benzo, no! Shit, is he already there? What kind of beast is this? It's Deckard, but... What the hell? This all ex escalated so much, so quickly. No fight for Vander? Is this revenge? I guess he was the train tra the one trying to drown Silk at the beginning and this is payback. Good one, Marcus. Yeah. Are you proud of yourself? See what you did. I'm so fucking mad, my blood is boiling. I'm so mad at Marcus. Not even mad at Silco because I get his stories different, but 
Marcus, please, bruh. Like. Bruh. Wait, can Deckard come back to the regular, to his regular form? What the hell? Can he even do that? Oh wait, is she going to experiment on him? Shit, no, don't do that, dude. Oh shit, got already? I love her uh, add-ons. <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, the jewelry she wears. Are we going to lose? Milo and Clagor too? I hate Milo, but I really don't want him to die either. Like, I hate him as a meme. <laughs> well, he's kind of an asshole and a piece of shit, but still I don't wish to see him dead. You gotta understand, Jinx. Powder. Sorry, I always call her Jinx, because it's so weird for me to see her called Power. Power Powder. Mm. No, man. She's going off the deep end already. Fuck. Run, Jinx. Run. No? I thought it was going to explode, but what actually happened was she had a shitty idea. I guess it's better than her exploding, but still. Shit, dude, we're going to lose them? All three of them? This guy seems... It really looks like the Jailer from World of Warcraft. And Zion a bit. Let's go, bye. Wanna see her <laughs> use them for the first time. I'm so hyped. So hyped for her to... Like, warm them up. She's so badass. Oh, one hit, the uppercut, get, sit the fuck down, son, get wrecked. Is he going to tell him to run away? Take a breath. No, he's, he believes in Milo. He believes in the getaway plan. What a bunch of bitches. They're fighting a teenager and they need to gang up on her? Like, she literally has... Scrap fists, that's it, Cestus. They have weapons. <laughs> She's such a badass. Is there a runic component to the... Hextech chorus? I have no idea. Oh, cause it's hitting it. Oh shit. We wanna see what it does to him. Is it going to maybe react or something? Like, maybe can it stabilize the fluid? Nice team. Oh shit, she flying? Fuck. Wait. He's fine, right? Oh wait, he, he's not. What the hell? 
I get them dying, but like this? This is so savage and beautiful for her. He's completely fine. Fuck this dude. And this girl. He doesn't even acknowledge she, sac she sacrificed for him. Like, is she even alive anymore? Oh shit, improvised knuckles. Wait, is he beating him? Or, I mean, is he stronger than him? What the fuck? Bandit is so strong. Even if he loses now? Who has done that much to it? Not even the fucking biggest explosion did. No, fuck. What did you do? Did he just... Inject him? Please, no. Wait, he just fell on top of the serum. Is he about to... Is he going to make it? Or is it too late for him? He didn't make it, man. Fuck. They had it. They literally had it. They were out. They were out and Jinx did it. The guilt is killing her, man. Fuck. Why did you lose me? Because you're a jinx. Do you hear me? Milo was right. Violet, please. This is so rough. Fuck. Makes me so mad. And she just leaves her there. Yeah, it is Jinx's fault. It is. But you also let her left be left her behind. You raised her and you made her like this, kind of. And now you abandon her. Uh, I always thought that, but why is a piece of shit? I'm certain now, a hundred percent. I used to think of it from the things I heard she said on the game, in the game, but she's truly a piece of shit. Did Marcus feel bad? Oh shit, I really didn't think this was coming. Poor Jinx. He feels identified. In, I mean, he can see himself in her. He feels like his own brother. I'm not sure if it was family or not, but Vander abandoned him. This is so sad to see him like feeling identified and actually like feeling for her because you can tell he does. All right, everyone, this episode was absolutely genius. I mean, 10 out of 10, no doubt. That was so good. Things went to shit like from minute one. I thought they would go crazy like towards the end. Like um, breaking uh, all hell loose, no, not like all breaking all hell, all hell loose, but like maybe a bit of craziness, given that it's the ending of the arc, the mini arc. But what the hell? 
it was so sad and so many things happened and from the very beginning it's been like what 40 minutes of fear shit that happened and feelings and emotions and so ma so much adrenaline what the hell I loved it and I'm really eager to see what happens in the when in, well in episode 4 is it still about Bai and Jinx is it about other characters in any case if I stopped to talk about every single thing that happened, we'd be here for like three days and so many things happened that I really want to see what happens next. So thank you so much for visiting my channel and for staying to the end of the video and I hope to see you all on the next episode. So peace out.